This is what my hair looks like when it's combed out. This is Harry Potter Sorcerer's Stone Hermione Granger hair. It was a dark and stormy night. Isn't it? Don't you think it's dark and stormy? What's up guys? It is currently 5.41 at night. And I just got home and has started cooking. I have. She is already slaving away. I know. And she's given me the task of cutting up the garlic. So I'm gonna cut up the garlic. She's going to do pretty much everything else. Because she's amazing. Hope you guys are having a great Wednesday though. Okay, garlic has been chopped. Anna threw in the sausage links and she had to, what was it called? Remove cast casing, I think. <laughs> Remove the casing? I had, I had uh, Randy was thoroughly disgusted. Talking about, ooh. He had to look away several times. I mean, it smells delicious, but it kind of makes me think, you know, maybe vegetarians got this thing figured out, because that was gross. I love meat too much to give it up, I think. It smells delicious, though. Right now, it looks like some sort of um, ground beef covered in onions or something, but it smells delicious. And here it is! What do you think? I think it's interesting. It's interesting. Mm -hmm. Have you had a bite? I have. It's good. It's just... I mean, it's good. It's I wouldn't good. say it's my best pasta, but it's oh, good. Oh, okay. Here we go. Mucking it off the list. How was it? It was decent. I would do it again. I would cook it again. Yeah. I didn't love it, but I would cook it again. Mm -hmm. I think the same thing. It was good. It was really good. I felt as if we had ordered a Italian sausage pizza. It didn't taste anything like this, but go on. <laughs> and we cut up some onions, took out the bread, took out the mozzarella. It's just really the Italian sausage. It was like, it's like, this is good. It's like if you took a, an Italian sausage pizza and macaroni and mix it in a little bit. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, we all don't have amazing palates. I, I went, my amazing mind. Amazing tongues. My mind went to craft mac and cheese. That's why I was like, no. <laughs> there were a lot, there was a lot of cheese in there. There was pasta. There was There's cheese. There's not that much cheese. There was cheese in the tortellini. Oh, in the noodles, yeah. In that noodle. Like, I didn't put any cheese in there, actually. No. It was tasty, though. I liked it a lot. Okay, good. I would eat again Good. for lunch. I, you are. Tomorrow. Yeah. We're going to do something non-pasta related tomorrow night for dinner because I have several pasta things on the menu. And, you know, too much pasta is never a bad thing. But I just care for his well-being. He's not a, He's not the pasta lover that I am. And plus, all those carbs, you know. I'm trying to space it out just a little bit. A little bit, but it is really Italian night, except or Italian week, except for our chicken fajita casserole that I'm doing sometime. So I was on Pinterest and I came across uh, like a list of hairstyles. I saw this one and I don't know why I love it so much. Probably because it's just so different. But I think I want to do my hair like this. And don't be too harsh, please, if you think it would look terrible on me. And also, I know it's not going to look exactly like this. I don't think there's a hairstylist out there that can, like, get you the exact look you want. But it could be close. So I think I want to do my hair something like this. Like, woo! No, just kidding. Like this. I don't think it'll be this short, and also, I probably won't get this as light. But I think I want to try something similar to this. And yes, my hair will be curlier than that girl's hair. She has, like, perfect hair. I don't know. What do you think? Randy likes it. Randy, 
thinks he likes it. But I don't know. And I think I do too, but I think I can't decide if I actually really like it for me or if I'm just desiring, like, intensely desiring something new for my life that this is standing out because of that. I don't know. I told my hair stylist I would take a few weeks to really think about it. I just want something new. That's all I want. Something new. It's 11.25. And this is what my cat looks like when he desperately is ready for us to go to sleep. Come on. He's staying there in the blurriness. There you are. Hey, Boo. How how ready are you to go? <laughs> how ready are you for us to go to sleep, hmm? Pretty ready? I guarantee you, if I were to stand up right now, he would run to the better. Actually, I don't know. I take that back. I can't make promises. He wants to go to bed? You wanna go to bed? <laughs> in there? You wanna go in there? <laughs> All right, let's go. I guess I'm going to bed. Well, come on then. Let's go. Your nightly stretches. Okay. <laughs> also, this is what my hair looks like when it's combed out. This is Harry Potter, Sorcerer Stone, Hermione Granger hair. I'm showing them my Hermione Granger hair. <laughs> yep. This For real? Is, yep. I, I, bushy. I, <laughs> it's, Super bushy. It's bad. It's bad. So this is what my curly hair looks like if I just comb it out after it's dried. Wow. I combed it out because I had a ton of tangles and I was fed up so I just brushed it all out. But yeah, it's a head of fluff. A head of fluff, and I want it gone right now. This is what happens when you look at pictures of other people's really good hairstyles. You want that. But this, this would never be that. <laughs> I have to find a version of this that I can tolerate. <laughs> oh, it's so much hair. Ah. left the ground as they lifted him and began to carry him slowly and surely back to the water and he knew there would be no release that he would be drowned and become one more dead guardian of a fragment of Voldemort's shattered soul wow that's uh, intense I just wanted to show you guys a clip of what I do with my little speaker I've been carrying it around uh, everywhere listening to audible on it I love that thing. I mean, Anna, man, what a great gift. That was an awesome gift. I think sometimes Anna gets annoyed with me because <laughs> I carry it around and just, I'm listening to Harry Potter right now. So like, she don't want to hear Harry Potter all the time, you know, like you wouldn't want to read everyone's books that, you know, you walk past in a library. Well, you kind of can't help that when I'm got it. I got a blaring on a speaker. So it's like a, it's like a mobile library reader. What? A librarian reading the book out loud to you. My sixth grade teacher read books out loud to us. She was awesome. She read Where the Red Fern Grows. I can't say that apparently. Where the Red Fern Grows. Where the Red Fern Grows. She also read To Kill a Mockingbird, which is an awesome book. It's actually one of our friends, Miranda Cranford. It's her favorite. So anyway, yeah, I love that speaker. I haven't carried it to work yet, but I think I will. I think, I think I'm going to, I don't know. I also love just the regular iPhone headphones that you can put in your ears because they got a little play and pause button, so I'm just listening to it at work. Pause. Someone comes in my office. It's easy. Tomorrow's work, regular day. Shouldn't be too much going on. I am going to return that kettle, though. I need to make sure I have that receipt in my wallet. I don't think they'll give me any problems at Target because it's still new, like new, and it leaks, so, you know. I don't know which one I'm going to get though, like, to replace it, because they didn't have the one that I wanted, so I may have to step it up and get one that's a little bit more expensive. Well, sound like someone just hijacked my speaker. 
at one point we hooked up Anna's iPad to the speaker and I think Anna is uh, getting ready for bed and she just started playing an iPad game. Is that what happened? Uh, yeah, she's playing an iPad game in bed. The audio came through. <laughs> I did not know what was going on. It's okay, it's funny. Thought Harry Potter was singing. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna go to bed. Hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. If you have, hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. We'll talk to you guys soon. We love you guys. God bless.